Hello, my YouTube friends. Uh, I hit 250 this morning, so uh, this will be the official giveaway video. It's going to be the Tops PR4 uh, Patrick Rollin or Rollin, yeah Patrick Rollins uh, take on the Kephart knife. Very good, uh, very good knife. Uh, the website says this is a Macarta handle, but to me it feels more like G10. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Either way, uh, I find it to be pretty comfortable. Whoever wins this, though, just a heads up. If you decide you don't like this handle on the knife connection, you can get G10 handles that are rounded and don't have this uh, Rocky Mountain tread on them. They look like good handles, and uh, I've talked to uh, one guy that has them who absolutely loves them. Personally, I'm okay with this handle just the way it is. Uh, if anything, I'd be tempted to make my own Micarta handles out of uh, buy a slab of Micarta and make my own. Uh, but I know how to do that, so not everybody's going to want to do that. But anyways, uh, all you got to do to enter this giveaway is be a subscriber, hit the like button, and leave a comment down below, and uh, you'll be entered. I'll let it run for a week. Uh, next weekend, I don't know if I'll uh, do it on Friday or Saturday, but next weekend anyways, uh, I'll do the drawing to see who the lucky one is to get this knife. I have played around with it a little bit, but I didn't too much because I didn't want to get it all marred up since I'm giving it away. Um, but uh, it, I made a bunch of feather sticks, and I did a tri-stick, which uh, if you don't know what that is, it's a stick where you practice all the different notches, and uh, it performed like a champ. And uh, Fat with Friday, I used the spine to strike a ferro rod, so it will strike a ferro rod. It's a nice sharp spine. It comes with this nice leather sheath that fits in there really well. Sorry, I don't. I'm, I didn't feel like going out and hooking up the. Uh, uh, tripod today, but rides nice in the sheath. It holds it in there very securely. Um, made in the USA, so is the knife. So there you go. And just a quick update on the uh, Buck 110. I put a castrum dangler on it, so now it hangs below the belt, and uh, it'll it'll. Uh, and when I sit down, it'll uh, spin out of the way, so it's not poking me, jabbing me, or whatever. I know not everybody likes a dangler, but I am fond of them myself. Um, you know, if you've ever had a knife and gone to climb into your car or truck and uh, had it jam into your ribs, you'll know why. <laughs> but yeah, that was easy. Uh, just a simple uh, dangler. Cost me, I think, about about 25 bucks off of Amazon. 24 something, I think. But uh, there you go. And this. Uh, spring loaded so it can take it off of here and throw it on another knife if you want to so I can work for for all your sheaths if you want whichever one you happen to carry for the day but that is not being given away that's mine I'm keeping that one this one however uh, I want to remind you that this was donated to the channel by the knife video channel uh, if you haven't checked him out already you should go on over and do so um, he's a great guy he uh, donated this and uh, the Cold Steel SRK Compact, which will be in another giveaway coming up in the future. Um, it depends on how long it takes me to hit 300, whether I'll give it away then or whether I'll just do a random out of the blue giveaway with it. But uh, whatever the case may be, it was donated to me to use as a giveaway, and I will use it as a giveaway. But this is the one going today, or well, next week, I guess. Um, I'll let this run for a week. Subscribe, like, comment and you'll be entered we'll see who wins it good luck to everybody and i'll see you later